Hi everyone, I just want to make this uh, as an update to the, my first video about uh, you know tinnitus. Um, so this second video I, I will probably title it Living with Tinnitus. And uh, I had tinnitus like uh, four years ago. Um, you know, it's a very, very frightening, scary feeling when once you had the tinnitus. At that time, I was like, I was like, you know, it's just the whole world collapsed on me. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know. I think I you know. I was saying like, this is it. I'm I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> when that hit you, like uh, you know, and at that time when it, when I have this ringing in my ears, I even doesn't know the name of this disease. I have to Google it. You know, I woke up one morning and I was thought that you know this construction going on on a Sunday. I said. That is so weird, you know. Why would somebody, you know, a company doing construction on a Sunday? Because I feel like like uh, people are drilling something, you know, on on the ground or something, or or like uh, drilling on the metal. That's the sound I'm hearing. And I have to, uh, you know, as on my first video, I have to w wake up my wife. Say, can you? Are you hearing that noise? And my wife like look at me. No. What are you talking about? And that at that time, at that that time, I you know the reality sink in, and that I was really like went to like a depression. So I have to Google, I have to Google it and find out the disease. So what's what's the cure? What you know? What should I do? And I find out there's no cure. You know, to be honest with you, there's no cure. A very small percentage uh, was able to get out of tinnitus. And I, you know, I do a lot of uh, video research here on YouTube, and I was, you know, I was again try to update it to share with you that I have the, you know, the things that I've tried and, you know, the things that work and uh, things that doesn't work, and also will cautious you uh, not to do certain things, understanding the fact here, and showing you, show you that uh, like a 50 million American. You know, suffered tinnitus. Uh, Twenty million struggle with uh, burdensome uh, chronic, chronic tinnitus. And then, like two million have have extreme cases. You know, so I I would say I was one of the two million. And the sound I'm hearing is like you know, like I said, you know, like people like drilling on the metal, and also I'm here. You know, I get this hissing sound. Okay, so here I do. Uh, I did the uh, how to heal tinnitus uh, search, and you can see there's a lot of um, you know people advising, and I just want to go through maybe one some of the things that I have tried. Um, one of the uh, one second here. Okay, I, I listened to this uh, motivational doctor. I did listen to him. Um, and then, uh, you know, I mean, he give a, a good advice, but uh, it just, uh, it helps me temporarily, you know, like uh, those uh, ear exercise. But one thing I would not uh, recommend is, um, I want to show you uh, um, an, Asian, uh, an Asian master that was teaching you uh one second here let me show you i'm not trying to bust this channel okay austin um austin go he was teaching uh you know um about um you know this uh, exercise and then you know he go you have to go like this and blew it you know try to hold your breath or something like that and then I don't know if uh, because I did that, you know, and then I find out when I went to my doctor, my ear has a hole and the doctor was saying, did you try something like, you know, holding your breath or something like that? Why did you have a, uh, you know, hole in your, on your ears? And I said, oh, yeah, I did because I saw this uh, YouTube guy was teaching you and, you know, maybe that's what happened. I was holding my breath like that, you know, and then also like poking this uh, two thumbs and then you're poking your ears like it's one of his teaching like that when I was doing uh, his teaching the tinnitus went away for like 10 minutes 
and then it came back so I you know just be careful uh, I just want to warn you uh, be careful so those are the type of uh, some exercise that you know you just have to be careful you know I just want to point that out and then uh, let's go scroll down uh, I did try uh, uh, who else did I try I want to uh, there's uh, okay the hearing he, the hearing therapy I did try the hearing therapy you know you download this kind of uh, strange sounds like something like that to uh, kind of uh, it just kind of put try to put a layer on your tinnitus this sound uh, hearing it doesn't help uh, one bit for me I'm not saying it doesn't you know it doesn't work maybe it worked for other people but not for me I downloaded and I was going on my jogging put the sound on it just didn't work I tried these pills right here you can see uh, it's called jingle jingle boloba extract I tried that uh, jingo when I tried that I uh, I tried jing, jing Goloba pills and I first time did not did not work and then second time it I thought it worked because I, second time when I wake up it's, it's so quiet I didn't hear any sound and I was so happy and then like half, a, half an hour later it came back it came back and then so I you know went back to my you know this bottle right here I went back and start taking um, the jingo again and then after that it make me feel I don't feel good uh, I don't know it's a kind of weird feeling it uh, I don't feel good is it a fake of this uh, pills I don't know maybe I was just not feeling good you know at, at that time I don't know and then uh, maybe I was a stretch out so I uh, and then I stop again I stopped taking this jingo and then uh, maybe two weeks later three weeks later I said maybe I should give it more try and I give it more try and it, it didn't work anymore so so uh, you know for me jingo did not work for me and sometimes I think it make me feel not you know it's not helping me I don't know it's just supposed to be uh, natural but somehow it didn't help me and then I, I don't feel good when I when I take that so I then I stopped after the third time I you know I said no chuck it um, so Jingo didn't work for me and and, and then uh, what else here there's another uh, guy here was teaching oh, uh, Julian Cohen uh, I did listen to him I did uh, I, I think he's the one that I would kind of recommend that you go listen to him um, you know it, it's pretty good you know Julian Cohen and then another person here let me find him uh, okay folks uh, this is the channel uh, this is uh, called the uh, tinnitus uh, treatment and this uh, man is uh, his name is Liam you can listen uh, he you can go to his channel and listen uh, to his uh, his method of uh, curing tinnitus uh, basically just give you a quick rundown is uh, you have to shut down your body uh, extreme diet control and like he was recommended like I think I believe I can remember correctly like uh, you have to shut down your body for one week or two weeks even two weeks uh, no food uh, just uh, salt just drink water that's all you do and you know and and he he, he said he he's, uh, he's tinnitus free and then he's also helped other people uh, came to his program that uh, also did the, the same uh, system the method uh, um, I, I remember only, only a handful of people that uh, was able uh, to be successful but that was uh, that was like uh, almost uh, at this at this six months ago when I was doing uh, my first video. So uh, and at that time I didn't try his method because I know it's not gonna work for me. I, I'm I work I'm working I'm busy I don't know how can I not eat for like 
one week or two weeks. So, you know, I didn't try the method and I, I know it's so difficult. Um, I, I'm i just not up for that one, you know. And then, so I did uh, try to find, uh, maybe you can say that I tried to do the easiest one. <laughs> okay, so, um, so what happened is, uh, you know, I was, of course, I was so down, so like, so depressed at that time. And then I was like... I don't know as uh, what else to do. You know, I tried the uh, the the sound tr uh, treatment. You know, the download sound, and then I tried the pills, and I tried the exercise, and it just get worse. I just like I'm so depressed at that time, and then I was like, oh, I just, you know, like very down. And then I, it, and then the final things is uh, like almost like you know, you pray to God, and then you know, hope for a miracle. I also like uh, reading that I know that uh, the, the power of mind, and I said, okay, I know that our mind are are very powerful. I know that you know we can tell our 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 mind, our brain something, and that will happen. I do believe that. So that's what I I I I, I did. I tell my brain, you know, I'm, I'm, I want to control my brain. So I start to. Uh, I live my fantasy. My fantasy is uh, my fantasy is to win the lottery, and I, tr you know, I, I so I, I have to do that. And you know, I'm telling you, living with tinnitus, the hardest part was uh, at night or when you're by yourself in a room when it's quiet time. That's the hardest part. But during the daytime, you're fine. You'll be fine. You know, you you're busy. You're, you're so much going on. You won't notice that. The hardest part was when you try to sleep, and my my tinnitus is on my right ear, so I cannot sleep on my right side. If I do that, sleep on the right side, it would felt too much pressure, and then the, the pressure will like um you know like give me dizzy, and I've there are times like I was like my brain will be spinning, and I will be like scared, and then I have to go you know. Uh, move it, move it to the other side. So I couldn't sleep on my right side or my tinnitus, and I, I you know, prefer to sleep on the side than uh, just straight. So and then, uh, so what did I, uh, you know? So I, did I try that? I said I'm going to live my fantasy. I just had to concentrate and uh, tell my brain just concentrate on the. Uh, the beautiful fantasy, what you know, what you know, the, my fantasy was to win the lottery, and I was that, uh, I was just go back. I I was just dreaming. Oh, I'm I am that I'm going by. I'm flying back, you know, to back to the Philippines. You know, I'm from the Philippines, so I was uh, dreaming that I'm going home. I'm going back, you know, uh, back to the Philippines, uh, visiting friends, visiting places, vis you know, eating food that I love, that I miss. Or sometimes I, I would dream about I was traveling, you know, to Paris, you know, having br nice bread, and then also traveling to Italy, like eating my favorite pasta, you know, truffle pasta, or you know, or whatever, you know, just live your fantasy. That's what I was I was doing, dreaming my fantasy, winning the lottery, and one of the I think the key was also. I always wanted to go back to New York because I started in New York. You know, I was working in New York be, uh, before I came down to Florida. So that's a, my uh, my. I always wish that I can go back to New York. I said, I wish I can go back to New York and work two more years in there, just to you know, just to I don't know. I just feel like, um, you know, like before I retire or something. I I you know I always want. That's my 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 dream. One of my dream. I'm just telling you my secret now. So uh, that you know, and then I said, okay, I have to. I'm just gonna think that this is. I'm in New York City right now, and the sound that I'm hearing is from the city. It's from the outside. That's what I have to, you know, um, tell myself. And I'm telling you, it worked. It worked for me. Because, uh, you know, you have to convince yourself, your mind, that uh, the sound that you're hearing, it's not only you. This is part of the outside noise, and everybody can hear it. 
it's not only you. So if you if you're gonna tell yourself, oh, I'm the only one can hear this this noise, this sound, it will drive you crazy. Don't don't do that. Convince your brain, the sound that you're hearing is part of the city sound. It's part of your surrounding. You know, everybody's hearing that. It's you know, it's part of life. And then I. For me, it worked for me, and then I, I, you know, I tell myself, "Oh, I'm in New York City. What else can I ask for? That's my dream." And I'm dreaming. I hit just, I just hit the lottery. I'm spending money helping people, you know, enjoying food. That's my, you know, that's what I did, and it worked for me. I when I do do that, the first night, the very first night, I was able to sleep good, and then I wake up, I'm happy. Say, ah. I beat it, so I, that's what I, I was doing every time I you know uh, every time that this if it if it happened to me like uh, sometimes I you know you couldn't help it when when this thing happened to you you know uh, you you will fall back and then you will start concentrate on the sound again. Don't do that. Don't concentrate. You you if you hear the sound, you you have to shut it out. Like I said, hey. That's the outside sound. You have to tell yourself that's an outside, outside sound, outside noise. It's not only you hearing that. The world is a, such a noisy place. You have to convince yourself. So, um, you know, and that's what I, that's why I, uh, I did, and it, it was remarkable. You know, I'm fine, and I have no problem sleeping. I, if I go to bed, boom, <laughs> sleep right away. <laughs> And and you know I, right now I also go to I go back to concert right it's summer in Florida we have this uh, free concert o o every week we have free concert at the park so I go there sometimes I sit very close to the stage you know I can hear I like to hear the music playing loud <laughs> so I go to event you know so I'm living a normal life right now I'm living a normal life and then. I try to. Uh, I I really like to help other people, like uh, you know, suffering from this tinnitus. When uh, whenever people commented, I it really hit me. I you know, I almost like when when somebody commented that, oh, I'm, you know, I just got this tinnitus. I don't know what to do. I you know, I almost like I want to reach out to that person and hug that person and say, no, n n never fear. You know that you know we are here together. We are here together. Remember, there's two million of us. So you you know you have like you just want to reach out to that person and want to say hey you know don't worry it will get better it will get better yeah so so uh, for for me is it is it I cannot say that it healed me because I still have the tinnitus but I can tell you it doesn't bother me a hundred percent it doesn't bother me I you know I have to I have to accept it you need to accept it. That this is part of the, uh, you know, the the city sound, the the noise, what's going on, this the word noise. You have to to accept that, and if you do that, you know, you can live like a normal lo normal person. So you know, um, yeah, I really hope that this video can help uh, because it, it, it's true. I'm the living proof. And you know, people, when you have a, any question that you know you you want to ask me, just comment. Uh, you know, I'll be try to you know happy to answer your question and help you the way you know as much as I can. So uh, yeah, just just uh, relax. Don't don't worry too much, and uh, you know it will it will only get better. It will only get better, and you will learn just like me. Learn to live with the tinnitus, and it's just part of the word. Of the beautiful world that we're living in. Thank you all for watching. Take care now. Bye bye.